So we got a report that the economy is actually doing quite well. And I'm just sitting here, I'm about to get my haircut, but I'm sitting here thinking about why that is not translating to everyone else. The stock market is doing very well. We hear that inflation has come down, but people still feel like it's a terrible economy and, you know, blaming Biden and his policies. When in actuality, the IRA, the Inflation Reduction Act, has put billions of dollars into our economy. And I think the administration is missing a real key point because the messaging is off. Y'all got to work on that communication and that messaging. Because when we talk about inflation and have allowed Republicans to talk about inflation in such a way, you would think that it is something that it's not. Inflation just means the rate in which the good or service is increasing in price. So if I, I don't know, sell a broom that I'm looking at, today is $5, tomorrow is $6, the day after that I charge $7, the day after that I charge $8, the next week I'm charging $20. The inflation rate is how many times or how fast is the price increasing on that particular good, whereas before, maybe I sold you the broom at five dollars and I didn't move up to five fifty into the whole next year, right? Because prices always increase, it's just the rate in which they increase. And then we're also seeing the stock market, but if you're not in the stock market and you're not invested, then you, are you really even seeing any of the money? No. And can you buy a house with these interest rates as high as it is? What is very clear with everything that's going on, with inflation leveling out, with the stock market doing well with our economy growing and unemployment down, these are just the hard fact numbers, what's very clear is that companies are price gouging. They're price gouging. And President Biden actually said it, I think maybe two weeks ago, I remember hearing him saying something, but they need to say it more so that the people, we the people understand that the policies are working, that the implementation of the Inflation Reduction Act, again, which gave billions of dollars or the Chips and Science Act that's gonna create so many jobs in this country is actually working. The money's coming. But the people don't feel the money, especially when we come from or have experienced that COVID uh, stimmy check money, when we actually had tangible money in our pocket and we don't have that now. So there, there's your disconnect, I believe. That's just my theory of the case. And they need to do a better job in communicating that it's actually companies that are price gouging, which is why we still feel the way we feel.